we're here at the Red Bull Dark Knights. I've been here since I think about uh, nine, I think. I think a bulk of the time was spent building the obstacles. We're just buffing up some parts that have been have been eroded over the past year. I mean, the, the trail is pre-existing, it's already there, but in the past three weeks, we've seen a lot of rain, so pretty much all our days were cut in half. First of all, it's kind in Singapore because we've never had a, a night downhill race. This is definitely a first when it comes to extreme sports. Huh? Welcome to Red Bull Dark Night 2011, happening in Cambridge Park, Singapore. The race consists of a elite, open, women's and juniors category. This is the uh, start ramp. The riders will filter through the chute and they will be here one at a time. So the first feature of the trail would be pincher. I mean, the reason why we call it pincher is because the tire hits a rock so hard, pinches the tube against the rim. This is the wall, right? It allows riders not to lose their speed through this flat corner. So right after this, riders will encounter the apex drop. It's um, a three-foot drop with roughly five feet of vertical drop. The showcase of this trail is called the creek jump and that 10-foot jump is definitely at an international level. And the elite category is starting for their run to tonight. Australia. I'm I won. Yeah, yeah. Well, I had a crash in the second round and got back on the bike and then just went out there and set some pretty consistently fast times and yeah, I was, ended up winning. I finished second this time, losing out to Daniel Sprat, who is my coach. We got to go back, um, do some more work, do some more hard work, train harder, and come back strong again. I'll be here next time for sure. 